Story of Prophet Adam, Peace Be Upon Him By Ramiz Abid In the beginning, there was Allah. There were no trees and no animals. There was no sky, sun, or moon. There was no Mama and Baba. There were no people at all. Then Allah made the sky, sun, moon, animals, trees, and everything that we see around us. Allah made the angels from light. They are always good. They always listen to Allah and never say no. Allah also made jinns from fire. Some of them are good and others are bad. The good ones listen to Allah and the bad ones do not. Allah also made a jinn named Iblis. He is one of the bad jinns and does not listen to Allah. Then Allah decided to make a man named Adam. Allah gathered dirt from all over the earth. Then Allah put it all together to make Adam. Adam was very good. He loved Allah and always listened to him. Allah taught Adam names of all things. Adam used to live in a beautiful place called Jannah. Allah also made a wife for Adam and Jannah. Her name was Hawa. Iblis did not like Adam. He did not like that Allah made him. Allah told all the angels to make prostration to Adam. They all did so but Iblis said no. Allah asked Iblis, Why did you not make prostration? Iblis said, Because I am better than Adam. You made him from dirt and me from fire. So Allah told Iblis to leave and never come back. Iblis became very angry and jealous of Adam. He did not want Allah to be nice to Adam. Allah told Adam to watch out for Iblis. In Jana there was a tree and Allah told Adam and Hawa not to go near it. They could eat from any other tree but just not that one tree. Iblis sneaked up to Adam and Hawa and told them to eat from the tree. Adam and Hawa said no because Allah does not like that. But Iblis kept telling them to eat from it until both Adam and Hawa said okay and ate from the tree. This was a mistake. Allah did not like that Adam and Hawa ate from it and asked why they ate from the tree. Adam and Hawa felt bad and said sorry to Allah so he forgave them. Then Allah sent Adam, Hawa, and Iblis to planet Earth. But Iblis did not feel bad at all. He did not say sorry to Allah and said he will keep coming after Adam, Hawa, and their kids. Adam and Hawa had many children. Adam told his children about Allah and to always listen to Allah and pray to him. Adam also told his children to be careful of Iblis and his tricks because Iblis is bad. Adam was the first prophet sent by Allah. Allah sent other prophets too. The prophets were the best of people. They were nice, brave, and loved Allah very much. We should all try to be like the prophets too. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We plan to do more Islamic stories for kids in the future as well.